Well, Keith and Katie, masks are recommended this school year, not required. They're going to have staggered dismissal times, and there will also be social distancing signage throughout the schools this year. It's also highly recommended that families and staff screen themselves daily with temperature checks and checking symptoms before coming to school. About 39% of the population 12 or older is fully vaccinated here in Clay County. And the positivity rate here, according to the Florida Department of Health's latest report, is 27.6%. That's from last week. Vicki Kidwell, president of the Clay County Education Association, the teachers union here, says not all of the teachers feel safe because of the relaxed protocols compared to last year. I think that in a lot of ways, if if we had the same tools, people would say, um, hey, we knew we could do it. We, we kept the schools open. Yeah, we had isolations. We had quarantines, but, you know, we got through it uh, this year. We don't know what's going to happen. Coming up at 530, we talked to a parent here in Clay County about her thoughts on the safety protocols this school year. For now, reporting live in Fleming Island, Kaylee Tracy, First Coast News on your side.